Hello friends, this video on Hello Alkanes and Hello Arenes part 28 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Now we will see that by adding some electron withdrawing row, we will see that the arenes, Hello Arenes are more reactive. So if we add electron withdrawing row, And that to add ortho and para position, we'll discuss this why. At ortho and para position, right? So it increases the reactivity towards nucleophilic substitution. So it increases reactivity. Because electron withdrawing group will take electrons, right? It will decrease the electron density. So the nucleophile is one which has more electrons is already electron rich so if the my compound is not electron rich it can attack for example i'll show you this particular compound if i have i have a chlorine here the one earlier one the same one i have seen for the same reaction let's try it once again it's chlorobenzene i had to add naoh 623 kelvin right and then 300 atmospheric pressure to form phenol. Correct? This was the reaction we have seen. Very drastic condition. Now, you see that if I add a nitro group here at the para position, so the same reaction, you again need NaOH, right? But now you need only 443 Kelvin. And you will get the same substitution reaction here. My Cl will be replaced with OH and my nitro will be here. You, you put one more nitro group here. So what you will observe here is, this is all experimental values. So you put one more nitro here. So what we have seen experimentally is any OH, it needs lesser temperature, 368 Kelvin to give or replacement reaction, substitution reaction actually. This becomes OH, this is NO2, this is NO2, and let me form the ring. Let me add one more NO2 here. This is what experimentally has been seen that there is a chlorine here, this is NO2, this is NO2, and this is NO2. So this needs for the less temperature, just you need to just warm it. Almost you can say uh, 300 Kelvin you get the substitution reaction. Now you have seen that we added nitro group only at ortho and para position. Right? As I told this electron withdrawing group will withdraw electron and it will become less electron rich and then nucleophile can attack, right? Because this is my nucleophile can attack. Correct this carbon. Now the question is why did we add only at ortho and para position, not at other position? Think. So let's see. Right? So we have seen that NO2 group is added only at ortho position, not at meta position. Why? So let's first draw a normal hello arene. Let's see what is there in that, if I can find something in that. So we have drawn this couple of times. Let me draw this once again. I have a chlorine with uh, all this. In pairs. So with this, this will give electron here, it will come here, it will form a double bond. Right? So it will form a double bond here, the positive charge, negative charge here, and this is the bond. More residing structure you want, you can make it this way. So this bond will break. You get a negative charge here, this positive it will come and positive it will form a bond. This is a bond here and it is a double bond plus. Let's again do this. Let's break this. Correct. This is a negative charge here. So if you see here, the negative charge is at ortho position, para position, ortho position. So 
what we have seen is this halogen atom right they also deactivate the ring as i told right but they are ortho and paradigmatic so with the halogen atom if you see the electron density is more at ortho and para position right so for hello alkene hello arene actually electron density is more at ortho and para so this is like this is one guy this is one let's suppose one person who has more money at these position right so if i attach someone or if the thief attack these position or thren para position then the thief will get more electrons right more money electron is like money electron is money and as i told if my compound is bigger is not having much money then the nucleophile can attack because nucleophile has lot of money nucleophile is has lot of money is has a lot of charge right negative charge so i want to make this guy more poor so i know i know that this particular halogene keeps more money at ortho and para position right so my no2 is nothing but electron withdrawing group they are thieves they steal money so if i attach the thieves at these position where this compound is keeping money because this compound keeps its money at ortho and para position then i can destabilize that i can make them weak but if i attach a thief here it won't make any sense because thief will not find anything here the electron will never be here right the beta position if you see there are no electrons not much electrons electron density at beta position is very less so if i want to destabilize this particular compound or if i want to make this bigger because if it is destabilized if it has less electrons it is more reactive So if I want to make this compound bigger, I have to attach thief. That is, N O two group is the electron withdrawing group. Nothing but my thief. I have to attach this thief at the position where this particular compound keeps its money. And the money is electrons. So this elect uh, this compound keeps its money in ortho and para position. Thus, if we add electron withdrawing group or the thieves at ortho and para. para position is effective else if you add at meta position doesn't make sense right the thief will be there but thief won't get any electron to see but if you attach this thief that is electron withdrawing group at ortho and para position thief will get electrons and then this particular compound will be devoid of electrons and will become less electron rich and it can it is ready for attack it is unstable correct so you understood why at ortho and para position only we are adding this electron withdrawing groups or thieves because at ortho and para position this particular compound has electron that is money so it is good that we attach thief or the electron withdrawing group at this position so if you see this uh, hello arenes so they have two thing one thing is they withdraw electrons right so if you compare with benzene since they withdraw electron they make it poor electron deficient actually they make it this is electron rich they okay, both are electron rich but if you compare benzene and hello arene this is more electron rich because this chlorine is trying to withdraw electron so that wise it is a is the, we are trying to attach electrophile here electrophile is one which are looking for electrons right this has more electrons so the reaction is fast this has less electrons so the reaction is little slow correct so hello arenes electrophilic substitution is also slow correct also it is ortho and para dieting so we will see that all the substitution will generally happen at ortho and para position we will see that hydrogen will be substituted with let's suppose nitro group or chloro group at ortho and para position we will see that since this is ortho and para dieting we will we'll see the reactions very soon let's understand that if you compare hello arene with benzene the electrophilic substitution also is slower in hello arenes as compared to normal benzene why because the hello arene has this halogen group which it withdraws electron and makes electron deficient right thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos 
try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.